conditionals, if sentences. Let's look at first conditional and second conditional. First conditional, if it rains tomorrow, I'll take an umbrella. Future situation, tomorrow, if it rains, maybe it will rain. So it's a possible future situation. I'll call you later if I have time. Will I have time? Maybe. I'm not sure. There's two ways we use this. So the first way. If I were you, I'd say sorry. I would say sorry. This is an unreal present situation. I'm not you. But if I were you, I'd say sorry. If I had 1 million euro, I'd buy a big house. I don't have 1 million euro. The second way we use second conditional. If I won the lottery next weekend, I'd travel around the world. So the lottery next weekend, next Saturday, it's a future situation. What are the possibilities, the chances of me winning the lottery next weekend? Very, very small. If it rains tomorrow, I'll take an umbrella. Well, if we're in Ireland, what are the chances of it raining tomorrow? Yeah, there's a good chance. It could be 50-50. If it rains tomorrow in the Sahara Desert, people would be happy. What are the chances? Very small. It's a very low possibility. So more or less, we could put first conditional is in this area. Second conditional is much lower. Imagine this is a teacher talking to a student. If you study hard, you'll pass the exam. If you studied hard, you would pass the exam. What's the difference? In both situations, it's the same exam. It's in the future. But in this situation, if you study hard, you pass. Do I think you'll study hard? Yes, you're a good student. So probably you'll study. And if you study, you'll pass the exam. This situation, the teacher is talking maybe to a student who's intelligent, but maybe a little bit lazy. So if you studied hard, you'd pass. Do I think you'll study? Small possibility. Which one do you think is better in this situation? Is Ireland winning the World Cup really a very small possibility? Or is it, no, it's real, it's possible. Well, I think first, I think yes, we have all these young players, yeah, yeah. Maybe you're a bit more objective and you think second. So sometimes if we use first or second conditional, can be subjective. It can demonstrate how we view a situation and how possible it is. And that's it. First and second conditional.